Hello everyone. We have already solved grade 1 SOF question papers of IEO that is English Olympiad and IGKO that is Journal Knowledge Olympiad. Today we are going to see the question paper of NCO that is National Cyber Olympiad and this question paper is for year 2022 and it is for grade 1. So let's solve it together. NCO question paper is divided into three sections. That one is logical reasoning. The second one is computers and information technology. And the third one is achiever section. So let's get started with the first one that is logical reasoning. Question one is dash is the costliest. So we have four options over here. A is fan which costs 98 rupees. B is clipper which costs 30 rupees. C is a pot which costs 80 rupees and the D is an alarm clock that costs 25 rupees. So costliest means the one with the higher value. So we have to now choose whether 98, 30, 80 or 25 which one is bigger or the higher number out of these four. So we know the one that is fan which costs 98 rupees is the greatest of all. So our correct answer would be A fan. Fan is the costliest. Let's see the second question. The number of circles in the given figure is that means we have to count how many circles are there in this diagram or in this figure. So let's count one on the top and four at the bottom. So total five. So we have five circles. So our correct answer would be option B, five. Question three, which of the following figures is exactly same as the given figure? So on the top, we have the given figure with all the options given that is A, B, C and D. We have to find which is exactly copy of the given snowman. Let's see option A. So in the option A, we can clearly see that the snowman is missing the hands. So it is not same. Option B, lot of things are missing, right? And along with that, uh, the color of the cap is also different. Option C, again, the cap is missing. Now let's closely look at the option D. It looks exactly same. So our answer would be option D. Moving to the fourth question. There are dash birds sitting on the temple. It's a tricky question because there are a lot of birds we can see. But here we have to only answer the ones those are sitting on the temple, not flying over the temple. So we can see one, two, three and four. Four birds are sitting on the temple. So the option A is correct option. Question five. There is a certain relationship between the pair of figures on the either side of analogy. Identify the relationship of the given pair and find the missing figure. So these kind of questions are actually the analogy questions where one pair would be complete and we have to find the relation between the two objects in the pair and then we have to fill the next pair based on the same relationship or kind of similar relationship. Here we can see the dice is there and then the game Ludo is there. So we know that dice is used to play Ludo game. Now on the second pair we can see that there is a symbol of horse. This symbol or this horse basically we find in the game. Can you guess? Yes, chess. These are the ones which we use for playing chess. So the right answer is option C, chess. Now we'll move to our next section that is computers and information technology. Question six, scrolling means dash on the computer. So do you remember that on mouse we have one scroll button? 
and uh, what is it purpose let's see all the option and then answer the question option a scrolling means pressing and releasing the mouse button b moving the mouse wheel up or down c moving the mouse left and right or d double clicking the mouse so did you guess the right answer now yes it's option b scrolling means moving the mouse wheel up or down and the mouse wheel is also called as the scroll button moving to the next question some words are given below a letter is missing in each word select the letter which would complete all the three words so let's guess what could be the missing first one is l a p dash o p now we know it is related to computers or information technology right so my guess would be it looks like it is laptop yes it is l a p t o p laptop but let's see whether the same letter completes the second and third word also c o m p u t e r yeah that's computer s m a r t w a t c h that's correct it's smart watch so our answer would be d that is t question 8 select the incorrect match now here there are four figures and we have to select which is odd man out the first one is a ups ups is uninterruptible power supply and it is the device that allows a computer to keep running for at least a short time of period when there is a power disruption b is mouse it is a peripheral device we all know that c is printer and d is speakers these two are also peripheral devices oh i think we are very clear that ups is the one which is the incorrect match it is not fitting in the group of other peripheral devices so our answer would be option a ups question 9 with the help of a computer you can option a check print out option b search information option c book tickets or option d all of these actually with computer we can do all of these we can take print out also if we put printer with it we can search a lot of information on google or any other search engine we can book tickets also so the correct option is option d all of these question 10 this key is also called as a dash key So this key you would have observed that it is present on our keyboards right you have seen the enter key now do you recall what happens when we uh, click on this key yes we generally use it to submit data or create new lines while we are typing right and this key is also called as return key yeah so the correct option is option a return question 10 we have already done <laughs> moving to the next question that is 11 which of the following options cannot be used to draw shapes in ms paint i think it's very easy because when we ho- we have to draw any shape we may use circle which is a shape we may use triangle which is a shape and we may use square also but the option b that is eraser that we are going to use not to draw rather to erase so option b is the correct option moving to the next question which of the following options is used to save power when computer is not in use without switching off the main power supply option a shut down option b restart option c sleep or option d log off So if you all use computer this question is going to be very easy for you all because the right answer is option C sleep Question 13 which of the following tools 
is used to insert letters in ms paint <laughs> again it is the easiest one because if we have to insert the letters we have to use alphabetical or numeral basically alphabetical keys right so the first one is paint bucket the second one is dropper the c option is rubber and the fourth option talks about what we use when we have to insert any letter that is alphabet a so our right answer is option d question 14 Some parts of computers are connected to it with the help of wires. Which of the following parts of computers can also be connected wirelessly? Wirelessly means without any wire. So have you seen mouse uh with and without wire both? Yes, we have seen. Have you seen keyboard with or without wire? I have seen. Yeah, both types are there in the market. But have you seen option C that is UPS with or without wire? No, I haven't seen and it's not there. It can be only with wire. So A and B are the correct options. For that, we have another option that is option D which says both A and B are correct. So our correct option is option D. Question 15. Which of the following tasks can be performed by using a computer? A drawing pictures can you do that yes we can very well draw pictures on computer B cooking food no that cannot be done C playing basketball on playground no we cannot ask computer to go on the playground and play basketball that is not correct D none of these that is also not correct because we have already seen that option A that is drawing pictures can be done using a computer so our correct option is option a drawing pictures question 16 match the following so we have two columns column 1 and then we have column 2 so column 1 a is can you guess what is what are these yeah these are speakers the second one is printer and c the third one is ups so let's match for speakers which is the correct statement in column 2 first it is used to print results on a sheet of paper na nah. second it is used to provide power to computer when power failure ha happens no third it is used to listen to songs that's right so the match of a would be 3 going to the second one so match of b would be first it is a printer and it is used to print results on a sheet of paper option c is going to match with second so a ups is used to provide power to computer when power failure occurs so we have to search for a3 b1 and c2 which is our option c a3 b1 c2 question 17 select the correct statement or statements a a computer can be used to play games that's right we can play so many games on computer b in school computer can be used to keep patients record no because we have patients in hospital not in school c at railway station computer can be used for booking tickets yeah that's correct so i think a and c both are correct and for that we have a different uh, option that is option d both a and c so the correct option is d question 18 which of the following keyboard keys would you use to type your age now if we have to type our age in digits we are going to use number key right because those are number and if we are going to type our age uh, in words then we are going to use alphabet keys right so let's search for these two a function keys b number keys c arrow keys or d none of these so we got b number keys we'll use b number keys to type our age 
question 19 select the odd one out with respect to the keys of a keyboard yeah option a is a key with c yeah so we have alphabet c on keyboard that's right option b is enter key we have enter key also on the keyboard option c is w alphabet yeah we do have that on the keyboard but what's this option d a smiley no we don't have any smiley on keyboard right so the incorrect one or i would say the correct one is option d question 20 dash is used to protect our information in computer so you know whenever you go to your gmail id or you are going to any site or even opening the computer also what do we use if that is locked what we insert and uh, what protects everything inside the computer or everything in our gmail id without which it does not open just remember that thing is it username is it first name is it password or is it last name the correct answer is c password password is the secret code which is used to protect our information in computer question 21 what is the use of given tool in ms paint so this is pencil and uh, we generally use it for the free drawing or free writing of uh, anything so option a it is used to pick a color from the picture no that is work of a dropper option b it is used to select a part of the picture no because there is another uh, tool that is selector c it is used to create free hand drawing that's the correct one d none of these no so option c Now a pencil is used to create free hand drawing is the correct one. Question 22 Identify the device you can carry it wherever you go as they are small in size and can fit in your pockets. It has a touch screen at its display as its display screen. Option A laptop. So laptop has a touch screen as its display screen. but we cannot fit it in our pockets right so that cannot be correct option b is totally incorrect because it is first itself it will not come in our pockets right option c is smartphones hmm let's think about it smartphones can be put in our pockets that's right and does it have touch screen yes a smartphone does have touch screen so This looks to be the right answer. Option C, smartphones, is the right answer. Question twenty-three: Which of the following machines is or are man-made? Can you please guess it? A, car. Is it man-made? Yeah. B, microwave or oven. Is it man-made? That's true. C, is a smartphone. Is it man-made? Absolutely right. D. all of these so we know our correct option is d all of these question 24 unscramble the given letters and select the statement which is correct about it so let's quickly unscramble it what we'll get i think we'll get booting that is b o o t i n g now let me explain about booting booting is the process of starting a computer as initiated via hardware or software and uh, when we say to boot a computer it means to load an operating software into the computer's main memory so now let's see all the four options and select the right one it is performed when computer is switched off no it is the first step performed to switch on a computer c it is performed when computer starts d it is the last step performed to shut down a computer So our correct answer is it is performed when computer starts option C Question 25 dash is a part of computer that is used to type letters in a computer do we type letter with printer no with mouse no with keyboard right or with microphone no 
Our correct option is option C, keyboard. Keyboard is a part of computer that is used to type letters in a computer. Question 26. Which of the following tasks can be performed using computer at home? A. Printing newspaper B. Watching movies C. Playing games or D. Both B and C I think we pretty know the answer. It's both B and C. We can watch movies and we can play games. These both can be performed using computers at home. So correct option is D. Question 27. Select the incorrect match regarding the keys of a keyboard. A. The first one. Is it M? Enter key. No. B. Tab key. Is it a special key? That's right. C. Function key. Yeah, that is a function key. D is a space bar. Is it the longest key? That's right. So the incorrect match is option A. It's not a symbol of enter key. Question 28. A wired mouse can have A. Tail B. Button C. Scroll wheel or D. All of these. So here we are talking about wired mouse with a wire, right? So it can have all three. Tail, scroll wheel, B. Button also. So the correct option is D. All of these. Question 29. How many machines names are hidden in the given word grid? So let's see from left to right and then top to bottom and see how many machines, machine names are hidden in this whole grid. I can see the first one already. So C A R car. Can you see the second one? C O M P U T E R computer. The last one is L-A-P-T-O-P laptop. So we have three machine names. Correct option is C3. Question 30. Identify the following. It is an electronic device that can print results on a sheet of paper. Hmm. We know that printer is the one that does the work, right? But let's see thus all the options. It can be used to print textbook, storybooks, comics, etc. Okay, fine. So first option A is printer, B is microwave, C is refrigerator and D is washing machine. So we already know our answer. Option A is a printer that prints result on a sheet of paper. Option A is correct. Now we'll move to our last section that is achievers section. Question 31. Which of the following words can be completed uh, with the help of given set of keys. So we have got five keys that is H, T, A, R and O. Now we have to see that uh, in option A, B, C and D like uh, whether these keys will fit in and complete the word. Let's see. Option A, S dash I, F dash. You have to guess what this could be. I think it is shift. S H I F T shift. So we have H in the set of key. That's right. We have T also in the set of key. That is also right. So option is option A definitely can be completed with the given set of keys. Now let's see for option B. It looks like that it is arrow. So do we have A in the set of keys? That's right. Do we have R and O in the set of keys? Yes, we do have. So option B can also be completed with given set of keys. Let's see the last one. S P A C E space. We do not have C in the given set of keys. So A and B options can be completed with the help of these set of keys. The correct option would be D, both A and B. Question 32. Which of the following tools is or are used when you want to do the given tasks in MS Paint? So let's see the task. Option, uh, sorry, uh, the first one is to draw a pentagon shape. Uh, option A is a letter. Option B is a pentagon shape. Yes, we can do that with option B. 
second one is to insert some text in the pentagon i think with option a we can insert some text in the pentagon now the third one is to fill the shape with the color so that can be performed by the color bucket right that is option c so a b c will be used to perform these things these tasks in ms paint so option d is correct all of these question 33 which of the following is our gaming devices a it looks like gaming device b camera c speaker and d all of these so the right answer is option a question 34 Which of the following options one when on scrambles will form the name of a place where computers are used so for that we have to on scramble these four options first a could be desk b could be shot c could be school and d could be port so uh, we know that option c that is school that is the right place where computers are definitely used so the correct option is option c question 35 Identify the objects shown in the picture pictures given below. Okay? Which of the following words can be found by using the first letter of these objects starting from the right? So we have to start from the right and then we have to remember the first letter of each object and then we have to combine those letters and see which word do we get. So let's start. The first one is table. So I'll pick T. The second one is owl. I'll pick O. The third one is umbrella. I'll take U. Next is car. I'll take C. Next is horse. I'll take H. Then comes pencil. I'll take P. Next is aeroplane. I'll take A. And the last is dog. I'll take D. So it is T O U C H P A D, which is option B. Dutch bat. The right answer is option B, Dutch bat. I hope you enjoyed solving this question paper with me. So uh, keep learning more, keep watching this video again and again, and really revise all the answers and understand whether you have really grasped all the concept of computers and information technology. I'll be posting many more Olympiad question paper uh, videos. So keep watching the channel. Subscribe it if you have not yet subscribed, and please share with other people also. Thank you and happy learning.